Okay, being a black folks, and basically I'm finally going to make a small short video. Now remember, this is my old channel. You can click and go to my new channel by clicking there. You can also click to my new channel. Well, basically, it's just it's my backup. So we're going to keep this old channel too, but you can click and go. You can click on this and go there, and you can click on this and go there. Okay, by going to my old channel, Beano Black. It's been around since April 6 of 2011. Okay, these numbers are liars because remember how I've you can go research the numbers have been uh, illegally high on companies who sell music. They try to brag that their stuff gets seen more. You know, it's record sale. They're not bragging about record sales because they wouldn't want to pay the taxes on something like that. But and then at the same time, there's a lot of people, i.e., certain people that are going to tell you actual factual static electrical. Okay. Static electricity, i.e. space, factual, actual, and everything like that. Data, truth, facts, okay? The truth is always what someone puts in someone's brain, brainwashing, okay? Everybody's got their own truth. Facts are actual facts. Concrete evidence, data, actual, factual. Even though it's science, it's actual, factual, electrical. Static electricity exists, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go scratch a cat, okay? And we get light curvature. Static electricity, yes, and low voltage transmission. That's right, megahertz and so forth and so on. We get a lot of different signals from the sun and a lot of planets in space. Planets in space put off electrical signals, the rotation, okay? So actual factual and then check out Rad Chicks, which she's got going on and then the last few videos that I've had pretty much too. Uh, we give you a good thing on a rotation there I do on that video. Uh, that gives you an explanation of what's going on besides what I'm actually bleed. I bleed the truth to you because I am tangibly wealthy. I can tell you the truth all the time. I don't need to lie to Americans or anybody in the world. Uh, I want to do business with a hell of a lot of people in the world, so I don't need to lie to anybody. Actual factual, okay? So you can click there. This is the old site that I really haven't had time to, I don't have time to take care of updating stuff on that. Eventually I will. Uh, I've even actually got some other channels that I haven't bragged about too much because I'm storing data places. Okay, so you might have been able to find that on the internet. You can do searches and so forth. Now let's get into what I want to show you real fast. I say it's going to be a short video, but we're getting some pulsations off of what I do believe is probably over by Jupiter or that planet from the meatball and stuff like that. Because if I, we'll, we'll be able to correct and know exactly where we're at in space when I look at some more footage in the next week or so. Because we can go back through the footage and I've showed you this electrical impulse because basically it's a light curvature it's an electrical signal it is communications ie fiber optic if anybody phone companies ever advertised and showed you a fiber optic there's light going through a fiber optic line okay communications ladies and gentlemen voice data okay electrical signal basically ladies and gentlemen okay a phone call is an electrical signal low voltage yes ladies and gentlemen okay now what we're gonna do is we're looking at the 19th Okay. What we've got is you can barely see it up over here, but when we go, you're going to be walking in this area up here, but there is an electrical pulse. And as you can see, if you watch right here, my pointer right there at that size, you can see it there on that footage. And we're over here blown up on the footage. I think I'm on the 14th here where you're going to see this blinking these stars. That's right. Correct. Way the hell off. That's blinking pretty much in, in communication, electrical connection to, and we'll pop down in size here real fast, just so you know, you can see that that's happening right there, okay? It's not the motion of the satellite that's making it do it or anything like that. Within the 24-hour time frame, those stars up there are electrically blinking, just like a neon sign with whatever we've got, because basically barely enough pulsing there, okay? No matter what, even at this low, small resolution, you can see it blinking on up there, okay? And then we're going to show you that pulse there that basically is amplified when we go, and this is the footage from the 14th, okay? And then this is footage, as you can see, it's, you don't even have, I don't even have to blow up on that at all, okay? From the 19th. But we will, just real fast, we'll just pop 400, boom. We'll go over. And then we'll get more up to where the, this is the planet that it was over by the meatball, that we ended up noticing that's a huge planet that's over by Jupiter that we really didn't know about that's in our solar system. 
and we'll get more of a look and get square weight on coordinates because we can historically I can go through a lot of the footage and uh, go and lock in on that now here we're on the 19th so we go up there and take a look at it and I think we were getting a little bit yeah so we're gonna blow up up here on the 19th we're still on the 19th we we'll go to the footage and we'll blow up to like 400 percent and we'll go up and take a look up there and see what we got if we get any kind of a revolution of it and I don't really know and you can just use your use your own eyes and see if that if you're getting it or not there's a little bit of see we got fast moving stars that you can pick out in once in a while you can see that there a little bit there but no matter what in this footage here even to begin with you can see the on and off blinking the lighthouse effect <laughs> of stars way the hell out in space in time with this down here because basically blinking is about as much as <clears throat> what we got blinking over here on the you see and that's basically should be Jupiter or whatever that is over there by that because basically the Sun is back over here left hand side over if the satellite was to do it uh, a 180 and roll around okay because basically Jupiter is more than likely up over here if I can remember right I'm only whether or not I'm right or wrong on that in the future okay so remember this is the 19th we see that there on the 14th and also some other dates on the 18th you can see it blinking okay it's blinking there up there you can see you can't miss it blinking okay and then it's very easy to see on the 14th footage you can see it blinking really easy up there okay so massive distances in space you're seeing the gamma ray coming across on the last footage that I showed you we'll pump up 400 in here and get a good look at that up there and you can see these stars blinking and they're way the hell it's a huge distance there's there's you can about imagine there's huge distances even between those two stars up there it doesn't look like because we're getting it and it's very bright and it's electrical energy from a long ways away and then we'll scoot over here a little bit right and you'll see that you have this pulsating action going on there and uh we'll go up and customize to like 999 real fast 999 i always say i'm going to make a short video i'm going to have to not fib rooney to you here real fast and make this thing that it's shorter because you can see they were mirroring me and locked me out when they were screwing around as you can see there's light now this is the magnetic line of a planet that's in in this one also more than likely i think this is jupiter here but then this could be the magnetical of that planet we found this could be a magnetical of another planet we have found we'll have to we'll end up knowing now this is a solar panel and you can see it bleeding through the side of it so we pop down to 400 I should have kept it at 999 and take a look up there real fast. I'll go over here because I want to be truthful of making a short video real fast. There's time, the date, and everything like that. And I am mirrored, ladies and gentlemen. So no matter what, whether you think that my computer locked out on me, it didn't. So there we're at 999. And you can see those stars there. I'll pull the magnifier out real fast. We'll take a look at that. Come on, magnifier, and then we'll pop up. Now, remember, I can't point, but we're going to be looking at that right there. It's not going to really change too much. Probably going to want to even know you some time on that being, but anyway, we get a better look up there of that, of those stars blinking. And basically, more than likely, since it's in time like a motor, like an electrical motor or like even an actual motor, as you can see, now you can see that it's those stars that are blinking there. But when we get farther away, you can see that, and then I can even get rid of the magnifier. I think we're at 999, and you can see that basically that's in time with that. And then we'll go, we'll plop out to make sure I remember what's, which one we were at. We were at the 14th, and you can see that blinking. Okay. And it's blinking, it's blinking right there. Can't miss that. Okay, so we go back to... You can see some blinking here, right there. You can see it blinking, and it'll pop up there. That's the 18th, and you can see it blinking on and off. We'll pop up real fast. We'll just go uh, custom right away. We'll go 999. Get up there and take a look at that up there. Electrical energy way out in space, ladies and gentlemen. There you go. So 
in time with that that we see on blinking on the as you can see here blinking okay static electrical out in space so our nice little fringe that NASA loves to put on there is started to block us on what date we got that fringe there but still there there but as you can see you can see the electrical pulse going way off in space and there's our and like I say, I'm pretty sure we'll know the footage when I blink out of this. Now what we'll do is we'll take the magnifier real fast, take a look at that. Because this is, I believe, we'll know the date in there so I don't make a mistake saying which one. And as you can see, that star cluster out there. So through the Big Bangs, more than likely related somehow to have that electrical connection. And that's what's blinking there. Is over there in the left hand corner so then I'll minus out as a matter of fact we'll just hit the magnifier and get the heck out of here come on get out of here boom, 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 boom. gone and you can see that so just thought it was pretty interesting and this was the footage from the 18th like I say on the 19th whatever's up by Jupiter I believe either that or the Sun our star in our solar system, that's what makes our solar system the star magnetical to the sun. No matter what it is, it's pulsing and it's pulsing along with what is way the heck off up on here on the 18th footage. Way the hell over there. And then also here from the 14th and probably every date in between too, the 14th to the 18th. I just haven't taken time to look. And you can see it blinking right there. I'll pop in at 400 real fast and then I'll stay to my promise that I was going to make it a short video. I didn't watch the ticker, but I thought I would show you that electrical action that's basically coming from there. Because no matter what, I think what are, the date that we're at here and we're seeing that blinking right there, that electrical energy from stars to stars to planets to planets. Blink, 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 blink. Star bright. And pulse pulse and that's what's going on up over there there to there huge distances huge distances in space light speed travel ladies and gentlemen it's all physics and it can be done